Hello everyone, my name is Linda Peterson and I'm here at NASCO working with Amoco's products. We're going to be discussing Friendly Plastic. And what Friendly Plastic is, is a moldable plastic strip. It comes in two different forms as you see here. It has a metallic foil applied to one side. And so there's a variety of different patterns and colors that it comes in, but it also comes in a plain pellet form, just like you see here. Now there's three different ways that you can heat friendly plastic and we're going to talk about those. The first way is with moist heat and that would be using something that like an electric skillet or as you can see that I have on the griddle here I have a skillet with a little bit of water because when the plastic gets Oh, when it gets warm, it gets soft, and that's when we can mold it into all different kinds of shapes and, and fuse it back together to create lots of pretty patterns. So that's what I have here, and I have my griddle here set to around 200 degrees. You want to make sure that your water is has a few little bubbles, but as you can see, it's not at the boiling point. Now the next heating method is, or the next two, are dry heating methods. And what I have here is a non-stick pan. I have a baking sheet here that's a Teflon non-stick baking sheet. And this is another method to heat. As you can see, I've already got a couple strips here hanging out. And they've already gone through the heating and fusion fusing process. And the third way to heat is with a heat gun or an embossing tool that you'll heat this the exact same way. You'll turn this on and you'll rotate your heat over the top of the plastic and make sure that it doesn't bubble because if it bubbles, it's too hot. And just remove it from your heat. Those bubbles should go away and then you can continue working with the project. And you'll also need a few tools. With Friendly Plastic, we have what we call a marbleizing comb, which I'll discuss in another video, and I'll show you how to use this. But essentially, we use this comb to create some really fun patterns. And we also use a needle tool. This is just a pointed tool that will also create beautiful patterns in your Friendly Plastic. So that's how to heat uh, your Friendly Plastic. And be sure to check out more of our videos because I'll be back to show more techniques. We're going to be marbleizing, and we're going to create some beautiful patterns in more videos. Thanks.